The next part that we're going to go through is called substitution. Substitution is like math. Just like how simultaneous equation work, you have to replace uh, x to y. So same thing. So I'm going to show you from methane first. React with chlorine because remember substitution with halogen. Halogen is group 7 of the periodic table. So I'm going to use chlorine. Now, all halogen exists in diatomic, so Cl2. And then must remember, I mentioned before, the condition required for substitution to take place is you really, really need what? Sunlight. Okay, I shouldn't use blue colour for sunlight, right? Okay. Sunlight, which is your UV light. Okay, so over here. Now, for substitution, just like math, only one H is being replaced. So, I will keep one H out. I will get this. Because one H is kicked out, one of the Cl will go in. So, I will have Cl here. Plus, because this H is kicked out, I will have one H here. Cl go in. There are two Cl, right? So, one Cl go in. I left with another one. They were attached together to give me HCl. So this portion here, this is called mono chloro methane. Mono chloro methane. Why mono? Because it's one Cl. Chloro because it's chlorine. Methane because the main structure is methane. So do I stop here? Uh-uh. You keep on replacing, replacing, replacing until all the H are being replaced. So the second part now is my monochloromethane fern. So here, Cl, instead of adding HCl, I will add what? Cl2. I will replace another H. Some of you that are watching, you have a question. I heard you. You'll be saying, Miss Selena, does it, uh, does it matter which H to replace? I'm glad you ask. It doesn't matter. At this juncture for your, for your syllabus, it really doesn't matter. You can choose any of the H. So, I will replace this H and I will get H with a CL. So, CL here, CL here and a H here. And of course, not forgetting my... Ta-da! HCl. Just now, with one, I'm called monochloro. So, those of you that are watching, uh, give me a guess. Well, what do you think this is? I have two Cl now. Okay, very good. Some of you say, oh, di, di. Yes, di. Chloro, methane. Chloro because it's chlorine. Alright? Methane because the main structure is methane. So, am I done yet? No. Because I have two more H. So, what should I do? Continue. Alright. So, it's very simple. H, Cl, Cl, and a H. Plus, Cl2, replace the next H. Alright. So, I will have Cl, 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 plus HCl. Hey, now I got three, okay? Oh, almost done. So what is the name for this? Think about it. Okay, let me draw a nice cross. <laughs> okay, this is actually called trichloromethane. Just like triangle got three sides. You have three Cl, trichloromethane. Okay, one more, one last one. So don't give up. We are almost there. Reaching the finishing line and Cl, Cl, Cl plus Cl2. And now you left with one H, my friend. So very quickly, let's replace it. Plus HCl. Three is called try. So four is called, think about it. What do you think will the answer be? Some, will think, some of you will be thinking quadrilateral or whatever. No, it's actually called tetra, tetra, chloro, 
methane. One condition that you must bear in mind, you must always have UV light. Got light, got reaction. No light, no reaction. So always remember your UV light. You need to have what? UV light. You need to have UV light and UV light here. So did you get this? 